Lily. So today we're gonna get inspired by this amazing wig from Janet Collection right here. And if you're new to my channel, don't forget to hit the subscribe button down here as well as little bell so you are notified when I upload videos every single week. So like I mentioned, this wig is from Janet Collection and she's in the style of Kim. And I'm so excited to try this wig because I have her in this gorgeous blue color and she is like ink dipped. Wow, look at this. It is so strikingly rich, I cannot handle it. So I'm so obsessed with this color. I love blue wigs so very much. She's pretty long. I'm gonna guess she's probably about 24 inches all the way down here. And then she does have some layers right here, some longer layers, and of course my favorite of these gorgeous waves right here. And then one thing I'll mention from the card, which I feel that isn't quite correct, is um, this top color is actually more of a white with like peppered the blue streaks if you can see right here. I feel that the card makes the top look more of like a platinum blonde, like a 613 that's more platinum. Um, while this is actually definitely more of, I feel much cooler than that and more white, if you will. Maybe the pink has a little bit more blonde, I'm not exactly sure, but I love it regardless what color the top is. So she does have medium colored lace right here. She does have some pre-cut baby hairs, as you can see. Also, this wig is heat resistant, so you can change the waves or straighten her if you wish. Um, as for the construction here, um, we'll look more into it, but she has this beautiful six inch parting right here. So that's really, really nice. She has two little baby combs right here in the front, and then she does have one comb in the back. I will say that she does have a more of a small medium cap. So if you definitely need like a smaller cap, this is definitely the wig for you. And then let's just flip her on this side so you can see more of that parting. Of course, we'll look at it more when we put her on, but absolutely stunning. I cannot wait to toss her on. So I do have a nude wig cap that I got from Amazon. I got a 10 pack for $5.99. I really like these wig caps. And I put my wigs on front to back. And okay, here she is. Look at this rich color. I'm just so obsessed with it. So let's just take a look at the hairline to see what we're working with. Um, so I do feel like she does need a little bit of attention on the hairline, but you know, that's pretty normal. Like that's not a big deal, uh, but she doesn't look bad um, with the colorings and whatnot. Of course, the center parting looks really beautiful. I mean, just look how beautiful that is, wow. All right, so let's come off this lace and get a her. All right, so let's just take our wig brush and lightly brush her out. Okay, so I'm back and as you can see, I changed my shirt. The purple was kind of killing my vibe with this wig. So from brushing it, I do feel like she did shed a little bit more than normal as you can see, but I also really cut the lace to the hairline since it was a little dark for me. So I wonder if I just cut a little too close. What I will say from brushing her with this heavy color right here, I did get some blue on my hands, which honestly, not a big deal, but I would probably recommend maybe not wearing uh, white or light colors with her, maybe until you wash her, if you do wash your wigs. All right, so let's take a look at the length really quickly. So yeah, so she is around uh, 24 inches or so, really loving these layers and just how beautiful wavy these are. And of course she isn't aggressive with the amount of hair, so she feels really nice. All right, so now let's play with the parting and whatnot. Of course, Kim is meant down the middle, but let's shift her and see if she gives different looks. So let's put her first on my left eyebrow. And yes, definitely a look that I absolutely love. I think this is absolutely stunning. I love when the waves like complement your face and giving different looks. All right, so let's shift her to the other side. So this side, definitely different, more on the face. So I would recommend that if you were to keep it on this side, probably just add some layers, just kind of lighten her up a little bit, or of course using heat to modify it the way that you want. You can, of course, pop it up, tease, do whatever you want, but this is a great look. I definitely love it, and she can do all sides. Let's put her down the middle again. 
She is truly a gorgeous wig. I really love it and I just love um, the really quick gradation of you know the white to the mid blue to this ink. I think it's absolutely stunning. And I'm sure the other colors look just as great. And there are more natural colors of this wig. So definitely check out all the different color combinations that it comes in. So let me know if you have this wig or if you have this wig in another color. I seriously want to see you rocking Kim out. So reach out to me on Instagram. That is the best way to share fun photos with me and just keeping me updated with how fabulous you all are. Because remember, life is short, wear a wig and have fun. And most importantly, it is your right every single day of your life to be as fabulous as you want to be. And if you feel fabulous in this gorgeous inky Kim wig, wear it, love it and own it. I want to thank you and we will see you soon. Bye.